Hey peoples, it's me Tristan and in this video I'll be starting the Dice Miniature Paint Guys Questing Night project. So first of all, uh, this lovely love letter. And then of course he sent me this chocolate bar. He went ahead and also sent me this pack of uh, Malifaux cards. The previous edition, or as I like to call it, the better one. And he actually sent the whole crew. Like, I'm really surprised. Thank you, Kim. I, I didn't expect anything like that. Thank you. So the deal is that I had this already here in my bits box, right, waiting for a project like this. And Kim only sent me a mount. I thought that it would be really cool to see a questing knight on, on, a, on a different mount than a horse. So Kim sent me this cold one. I think it's one of the older ones because it's on, it's it has this raptor raptor like look. Unfortunately, it came without a tail, but I'll manage. I'll green stuff and work something out. The idea will be something like this. Of course, I'm gonna have to green stuff and pin stuff and do the base work and everything but as Justin who is also taking part in this project has exactly the same mini so I thought it would not be that cool to have two exactly the same minis even though their mounts are different but and I had this idea to change out the head uh, luckily it's not connected to the musical instrument here so I can just pretty much cut it off and put on a new head. So at the moment I'm thinking about one of these two. I, I would like this head. This is from Warlord Games, a plastic a British infantryman's head or something. But I, I'm afraid it's a bit too small. But I also have this old Bretonian uh, man-at-arms head with this lavish huge mustache. Okay, I've got so far that I cut off the head of the knight and I replaced it with this one. I went for this one because I like that it has the eye patch on it and a little bit of a beard thing going on here. And this ragtag hat. I will green stuff the hat a bit to make it uh, more suitable. I'm gonna go for this uh, kind of like wizard Gandalf hat with this little tall pointy end. Then I'm gonna have to pin the head to the body, green stuff some chain mail on there, like cover up the place where it cut the head off. And then basically this guy is ready to be painted. He doesn't fit perfectly on top here and there will be a huge gap in the back here so I have to green stuff like a saddle or some something similar to that. And I'm gonna have to green stuff a tail and to this raptor. I will be using this as well because it's is a characteristic piece for the questing knights. It's coming along nicely. Okay, I've gone i I've got so far that I've pinned the knight on top of the mount and I've finished the hat and the chainmail around his neck to cover up the cut marks. Mm, let's see here. I also start some green stuff work to cover up all these gaps here. Still uh, gotta work on it. The knight himself will be here. That's the hat. There's some chain mail going on. Still a lot of work to do with the tail. I'm gonna give it my best shot. And this backpack piece will drop here in here so as you can see it would leave a huge gap first thing I gotta do is build up a saddle green stuff all these parts here and make the saddle front part here and also make some uh, yeah and work on the base so still a lot of work to do before I get to painting it but that's my update on it Thanks for watching, keep it safe and I will talk to you in the next one.